Oh, what the heck. Hello, everyone. So, if you don't know, we reviewed a channel called Slick Moth. Now, this channel was a kind of like a superhero news channel, but now things have changed. They're still keeping to that, most popularly for their Batman Arkham videos, but ever since the dire down of a Batman Arkham game or a Superman game, things have changed, they have, and considering they were not at E3, and I bet they're not going to be at Gamescom, depending on when this comes out, um, it's honestly sad because Spider-Man is taking all the hype, that's fantastic, I'll probably play it or pre-order it whenever, but it's sad to see what hype they used to be for Batman, now gone away, so now was updated but first here's that channel with you hello everyone so today we're going to be reviewing a channel that you may or may not have actually know of he um, covers Batman Arkham content every now and then do reviews uh, maybe talk about the spider-man game or anything else that he really wants to but you may many of you may know him just for the Batman Arkham stuff and today we're going to be talking about slick moth we are so yeah it's a totally fair criticism and in this video i want to sort of address that um clarify this and if you have no idea what i'm talking about basically quick recap well over a year ago it was leaked that um a new batman game has been in development by many different sources made by wb games montreal this game has been leaked to be many different things among others to feature a batman that is actually damian wayne the bat bike um some particular villains we've not seen very often before that i have seen some images of and we'll get into that a little bit later and also in future videos that i want to get into but first of all let's start with the initial criticism that i make all of this up to get views to get subscribers um first of all i will say this you know this has not been really a concern of mine ever since i've been on youtube i figured we should cover the basics of this youtuber he's got 65,000 subscribers with the views being in total of 90 million and whatever numbers he joined on the 9th of July 2010, so pretty much five years after YouTube launched, which is wow. I hear that if you started in 2010 or 2008, you can get pretty much a lot of views. Now, to, to this day, what is his most popular video? Well, His most popular video is called Never Before Seen Trasia Easter Egg. Uh, um, I don't know what this secret secret town womb. I don't know what any of that means, but it has 1.9 million views and it was uploaded five years ago. If you are subscribed to Addis Games, you should know that I have an Addis game gaming time show where I basically cover different gaming news or talk about stuff that I would want to and when it comes to the Batman Arkham stuff this and Caboose is my main source of info where where I get it and then I talk about it every now and then I will link their either channels or videos in the description I will because well it's just nice to it is and I will say it is a good place. In fact, you only need to really watch the first two minutes of their videos these days to actually get the information you want. So, are they good for wireable, good wireable sources? Um, to me, yeah. But, here's where it comes to this. Um, it seems to me that, um, and it's always good to be real with your viewers. So, um, I don't actually say this, well, um, in the past he has said that he just thinks that Batman Arkham Origins is not part of the Batman Arkham timeline. Now, that video was probably made, I don't know, a couple of months ago or a year ago. I'm not too sure if his opinions has changed on that, but if you do actually know that the Batman Arkham Origins game is part of the Batman Arkham timeline. There are literally multiple timeline videos on the internet basically saying that and also I've done a timeline video which is not 
it is wrong. I was a comment in that video that she made it correct, but considering YouTube's doing all this stupid stuff, I don't need, I don't even know if the comments are still there. He's also for he's also said that um, well, Batman Arkham Knight. Well, basically, it was disappointing. Me, I love it. I love it more than Arkham City because I feel like. I've played Arkham City so many times that I get so bored of it. It's nice to come back to every now and then, but Arkham Knight, because of the updated graphics and the big world, and you can play as multiple characters, it I quite like it, I do, where you can play as multiple characters, and it is quite amazing. It is, and yes, I know we were all disappointed when no Superman game was announced at E3. I, I know, I, I feel the pain. So, what do I actually think of this channel? Well, in my head, there may be views of not just me, but of other subscribers who watch these videos may think that, oh, hey, um, I know Arkham Knight wasn't disappointing, or The Last Jedi wasn't disappointing. That, but then also, I do think. He is a good, reliable source of info. So if you are looking for content like this, um, please be advised that he will take multiple breaks during the time that he does YouTube. Uh, his last video was uploaded two weeks ago, and with subscriber ranks up to like 65,000 subscribers, it's very rarely that a channel that I review will see this video. So Sigmoth, if you're watching, hi. And how much of out of ten do I give this channel? Well the thing is is that when you I don't know, make videos like this and you have views it's just the the bad parts just go away in my head. But I still have to do what I need to do. This channel gets a nine out of ten. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, um, yeah, nine more episodes to go, eight more episodes to go until season two, can't wait. Anyway, here's the next channel I'm going to be reviewing, and one, I am never going to review Lucas the Cool Guy. Alright now, so you've just seen that, here's an update. So, how many subscribers does this channel have? Six, 69k, with views being 19 million, and they joined on July the 10th, 2010. The most popular video today is new, uh, never before, uh, Easter egg with 1.9 million views. Sorry, the title was too long, and there was like one word I couldn't read. Anyway, so now what do I think of this channel? Well, again, when I did this channel with you, most of the thoughts are still quite new. As of what used to be a Arkham like channel where they would talk about stuff, has now actually changed into like, I don't know, into I don't give a fuckness. Now, I don't know what score I gave Slick Moth when we first did this, but. I have changed my mind on some few things and the change score for this is now a 7 out of 10. Actually no, you know what, I changed my mind, 5 out, uh, five out of 10 for saying Arkham Origins is not canon. Like I, The only reason why I made this video is because you said it wasn't canon. They literally reference it in Arkham Knight.